because it is fighting for justice and accountability. Breaking news tonight from Milwaukee's south side. The medical examiner has been called to a shooting near 15th and Beecher. Fox 6's Jerrica Williams is there alive. Jerrica, you've just arrived on the scene. What can you tell us? You guys, this scene is very, very active still. Milwaukee police were called here about 8.20 tonight, and they found a 35-year-old man fatally shot. Take a look at the scene behind me right here. We have investigators still on the scene. As soon as we got here, we spoke with someone who heard the situation go down. He says he heard about four shots ring out. Then he saw two people on bikes right away. A little bit later, he looked over and saw a body laying in the street, and he actually called 911. Right now, we're still waiting for some details from police, but we do know it's a 35 Five year old male, and they're out there investigating right now. Um, this is actually the fourth homicide since Saturday that Milwaukee police are dealing with. And actually, tonight it's been a pretty busy night for Milwaukee PD. They're also investigating another shooting that happened on 3rd Street um, about 8 10 p.m. tonight. That victim is a 43 year old man who was shot during an apparent armed robbery at Sparkle. Now, we're told that victim was a store employee. Uh, we're still trying to understand what exactly happened here, who this victim was, what was the motive. Lots of details to figure out, but we'll bring you the latest as soon as they come about. Reporting live from Milwaukee Southside, Derricka Williams, Fox 6 News. All Guys. right, Derricka, thank you. Elsewhere, the two 13 year olds accused of killing a 78 year old woman are now pointing the finger at each other. The victim is a Sheboygan Falls woman and